You're about to hear an apology from a 15-year-old, part of the gang that gay crashed a Bigton wedding and turned it into a violent confrontation. The boy's mother brought him to Channel 9 this morning so he could say sorry. At the same time, two of his mates were facing court over the brawl. They're ugly pictures that show an ugly side to our city. Today, an apology from one of the teens involved. Um, I'm sorry for um, of what happened to the wedding. I'm sorry for that and I'm sorry for the guests what got hurt. 15-year-old Emilio was at the Bicton Cafe Saturday night. He says he asked one of the wedding guests for a cigarette. Today, Emilio watched the footage alongside his mother as rocks, bricks and bottles were pelted at guests. I didn't throw anything. It was all my mates, it wasn't me. I couldn't control what they were doing. Seven guests in total at Stacey and Bevan's wedding were hurt. The groom's sister suffered deep cuts to her leg, needing more than a dozen stitches. It wasn't publicised, it was a private event and, you know, they've come down to, to inflict, you know, harm onto people and we did nothing to deserve it. Overnight, police charged a 14-year-old and 16-year-old boy with grievous bodily harm and criminal damage. They face court today and were remanded in custody. Must be an awful day for your family. <laughs> no comment. It's little comfort for the newlyweds. Stacey and Bevan say before the incident, their big day was going perfectly to plan. Just a couple of hundred metres away, their ceremony was held and it was only when the sun went down that the trouble started. It's been really nice that strangers and all of our friends and family have got behind us. Andrew Nelson, Nine News.